Philip Schofield exposes dancing on ice secret. The deep frozen cousin on Strictly Come Dancing, Dancing on Ice is set to return to the box this January after nearly a four-year break. But cheeky host Philip Schofield has unveiled that the ITV figure skating program was in talks to return after just a year off our screens, with the 55-year-old having to keep it secret for nearly two years. Speaking at the launch for the new series, which was held at the Natural History Museum ice rink, he explained, I can't wait. We've been talking about this for years, we found out about this a long time ago. As it got closer and closer, it definitely looked like it was going to happen. We were talking about bringing it back a year after it came off. I think it's safe today from two years ago it was definitely going to come back. Philip Schofield we were talking about bringing it back a year after it came off. I think it's safe today from two years ago it was definitely going to come back. However, the TV staple added that the new series was going to look significantly different to the show fans knew and loved since 2006. It's not a relaunch or a revamp, it's fundamentally different to the way it was before, he said. We know what's expected from the show and there seems to be a real expectation this year. We're excited. Philip will be joined by original host and TV wife Holly Willoughby, who also fronts This Morning with him. Holly's return comes after she left the show to do The Voice in 2012, and was replaced by Christine Bleakley for the show's final two series. And the scoff tease that their legendary partnership may be different this time around. When Holly and I did the first show, it was different, she had just come off Saturday morning TV and then there were nerves as we had a responsibility. Now we know each other so much better so there is none of that. We work as a team, we know what the show is and we know what's expected of us. The love that Dancing on Ice has received is incredible. Dancing on Ice returns Sunday 7th January.